September the 9th is in the books here on Wall Street. Here's the New York Minute. It's been a remarkable day. Bond yields surged upwards across the world with the 10-year German Bund yield even going positive, having been negative for a long time. As for stocks, you saw a big sell-off across the world, particularly here in the US, where, as you can see, the S&P 500, which fell more than 2%, breaking a long period of calm, fell gradually throughout the day. This was not a one-off reaction to one piece of news. In particular, if we take a look at the implicit probability of a rate hike later this month, it's not about the latest swing of opinion about the Fed. It really didn't move all that much. So what is going on here? I suspect it's something more deep-seated. If we take a look at how dividend stocks have been performing, you can see that they've recently lost a lot of ground compared to the rest of the market. Similarly, if we take a look at defensive stocks, you can see that cyclicals are now actively outperforming them for the year. My suspicion is that people are at last questioning whether rates can stay this low forever and getting out of those sectors that have been distorted by the hunt for yield. And that's the New York Minute.